how to find the text to image prompt on canva.com to start creating graphic designs based off of the ideas in your head, right? So we are going to go to canva.com. Now Canva is a free website design tool, but um, you can also sign up for their membership, which gives you a lot more access to their features, but you can use the text to image design feature without needing to be a part of the membership, which is a really awesome thing. Okay, so you're gonna go to canva.com. You'll need to create an account with them. Again, it is a free design tool that you can sign up for their membership, but you'll still need to create an account even if you're using it for free. Once you get into Canva and have an account, you'll go to the upper right hand corner and click create a design. You'll be able to find the different templates of a design that you would like to make. Now, if you have a very specific type of design, which I do, I'm going to be making playing cards, right? I'm going to be making Oracle card decks for my project. Um, you can also custom your size. So you would just scroll down to the bottom here and click custom size and then you would fill in your size now you can also adjust it to pixels inches millimeters or centimeters i'm going to go ahead and choose my custom design and once you choose the design that you want whether it is one of canvas templates or your own custom design canva is going to open up the design page for you to get started now You'll see on the design page that they'll offer for you certain templates that you can utilize. And as you're creating your design, you can actually combine it with the images that you're making through the AI feature or with what Canva already has in their graphics. Okay, but in order to find the text to image AI feature, you'll need to scroll over to the apps. When you click the apps, you're going to possibly see it right here. It shows me text to image prompt feature right here at the top. Now, if you don't see it at the top, you can also scroll down and you'll see it at the bottom here where it says popular or create something new. And the purple icon is the text to image prompt. Now you're going to click that and it will open you up into the window that you need to start creating your ideas. So let's just walk through what is here and available to you. So the top part with this little box is actually where you write your text. You're going to write your ideas and um, be able to generate any sort of images. If you, if you scroll under that, you'll see that it says styles. The styles um, give you options in which the AI art can pull from. If you click here to see all, it will show you all of the styles that are currently available to Canva, but I promise you that Canva is changing and updating uh, consistently because when I first started this, they didn't have as many um, options, but now they have even more than before. And so we are able to choose whichever style we want to create here, which is really awesome. If you go back, you'll also be able to choose an, a ratio. So for example, you could do a square, you can do a landscape or a portrait for the image. And this does matter because even though you have dimensions for your project, how Canva produces the AI image will be based off of these aspect ratios. So because I have a very specific uh, dimension, I'm going to choose portrait to um, be able to match it to what I have, which are these plain Oracle cards. And that is how you find the text to image prompt feature in Canva. In the next lesson, we are going to test and experiments on the styles so that you can get acquainted with the styles that are available on Canva.